Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Jam. In today's video, I'll introduce you to one of my friend's family that is parts of speech. They have come themselves to tell you about different parts of speech because it is the most difficult topic and it is the most important topic of English grammar. So to make it easier, they have come themselves to tell you what it is. So first of all, we have Mr. Noun and his wife Mrs. Verb. They have a son named Pronoun. They have daughter, adjective, one more younger daughter, adverb. They have two servants at their home. One is preposition and other one is conjunction. Last but not the least, they have a family friend named interjection. Now the parts of speech family is coming to introduce themselves one by one. First of all, Mr. Noun. I am the head of family. I am found everywhere. So you can see this is the actual definition of noun. What is noun? A word that is the name of something, person, place, thing, quality or idea. This is what the name given to this head of the family. He is found everywhere. That's why he is given this title. So just like Rahul, Raghav, Mumbai, Pen, whatever we see around us that is noun. I am Mrs. Verb. I always keep on doing one or the other thing. I am always in action. It happens in every family. You know children who does most of the time work in your family? That is your mother. That is your mother is always in action. Sometimes she is doing some cooking job. Sometimes she is doing the cleaning task. So she is always busy. This is what Mrs. Verb also does. That is what the definition of verb. A verb is a doing word that shows an action, an event or a state. We have examples, run, play, sing, go, watch. I am Pranam. I am son of Mr. Noun and Mrs. Verb. I love my father, Mr. Noun, very much and does all his work in his absence. Yes, children, this is what happens. When father is busy in doing some work, his son always holds the responsibility of doing that work. This is what this family member does pronoun and this is what the definition of parts of speech that is pronoun. It is a word used in place of noun. For example, Ram is playing football. Ram's brother is reading a book. Children in this sentence, in spite of repeating Ram second time in the same sentence, will use pronoun his. I am repeating the sentence again. Ram is playing football. His brother is reading a book. I hope it's clear to you all. Hello friends. I am executive. I love my father noun and brother pronoun very much and keep on appreciating them whenever I get chance. So children you can understand what is the role of adjective. It describes or modifies noun or pronoun in a sentence. For example, handsome, red, intelligent. We always say handsome boy, smart girl, red pen, whiteboard. So you can see that it is this noun or pronoun is always preceded by adjective. Hello friends, I am Adverb. I love my mother Mrs. Verb and sister adjective very much. I keep on modifying them always. Yes children, this is the habit of the girls. They keep on improving their mothers wherever it is required. So this is what Adverb is doing. She keeps on modifying her mother verb. So the definition is the same. It is a word which modifies a verb or adjective. For example, she runs fast. How she runs? Fast. So run is a verb and adverb is fast. Hello friends. I am preposition and chief servant of grammar family. I obey my master, Mr. Noun and his son, pronoun always. Yes children, as grammar family has introduced itself, so now it is the turn of preposition. 
as per the definition it is a word used before a noun or a pronoun so for example the book is on the table i live in ludhiana so you can see this preposition as its name indicate preposition so it is placed before a noun or a pronoun hello friends i am conjunction and you can call me a man friday of grammar family because i do all kinds of tasks of all family members so children as conjunction has introduced himself as the man friday of grammar family so you can understand what is man friday that is the one who can do all kinds of work for everyone in the family whether it be a noun it's a verb pronoun adjective adverb means he is helpful to everyone so this is what we see in its definition it is a word that joins words phrases clauses or sentences so conjunction means actually to conjunct to join like he and she handsome and smart in the car or by the train so it is simply joining words and it doesn't affect the meaning of the sentence buddy hello everyone i am in the jackson a family friend of grammar family i join all the family members in the times of choice or sorrows so children this is the definition of interjection it is a word used to show a short sudden expression of emotion for example wow what a beautiful picture it is and alas i am undone i hope it's clear so children you must have understood these eight parts of speech we have noun that is the name of something we have verb that means doing words action words we have pronoun that is used in place of a noun we have adjective which we have considered as as a starter used to describe or modify noun or pronoun we have adverb used to modify verb or sister adjective we have preposition chief servant used before a noun or pronoun we have conjunction that is joining words joining all the family members and then interjection that is sudden expression of emotion i hope with this video you are clear about this topic that is parts of speech you please mention the same thing in comment section thank you